Well, the Sistine Chapel ceiling took years to paint, and it's been an inspiration to those who see it for more than five years hundred years and now you will have the chance to learn more about the Sistine Chapel at a traveling exhibit that's coming to Grand Rapids. The immersive experience of Michelangelo's most famous piece of art coming here to the Gerald R. Ford Presidential Museum that starts tomorrow. Our Ruta Olsenaida got a behind the scenes look. Good morning Ruta. Good morning. It was really cool and it really is one of the most recognizable pieces of art in the world right and one of the largest covering over 5,000 square feet of space. With its massive size though it may be hard to see all of the intricate details that Michelangelo painted by hand if you visit it itself in Italy but now you can see the piece up close without booking an international flight. The Renaissance period gave us music, new ideas, and of course, art. And now a historic piece of art born out of that time period is coming to Grand Rapids, the Sistine Chapel exhibit. We're opening in Grand Rapids, of course, and that's a special city to me. Martin Bialis is the CEO of SEE Global Entertainment, running these exhibits all over the world, including this one. And although he's found success as a businessman based out of Europe and L.A., he's coming home to his roots. I was born in Germany, and uh, I came as an exchange student to Grand Rapids in 1975 and Ford was president at the time. And he's bringing his Sistine Chapel exhibit with him, an in-depth look at one of the most recognizable pieces of art by one of the most famous artists in the world. Michelangelo, of course, one of the most iconic artists ever. Seeing the piece up close is a unique experience since in Italy, the experience is very different. If you're in the Vatican City and you're inside of this building, you look up at the ceiling, it's about 45 feet high, and you're just packed with people. You're not allowed to take photographs, and you, you just feel like you're a sardine in a can. Henry Ludic Heisen is a local art historian who's excited for everyone to have the opportunity to experience the complicated, rich art up close. So there's a lot of things that are going on that aren't just religious. Some are going to be artistic. Some are going to be deeply political. You'll be able to see the numerous frescoes that Michelangelo worked on using a printing technique that emulates the feel of the original from your very own backyard. So again, the exhibit kicks off tomorrow. It goes until September the 11th. Tickets are already available. They begin at $15 for adults, $9 for kids, and it is free for anyone under five years old. Of course, we have more information on our website as well. And that was a little behind the scenes preview. So if you saw in the video, they're still kind of putting it up, but you'll be there tomorrow for the big opening. Yes, grand opening tomorrow. So we'll be there live doing live interviews, talking about all the things you can experience there. So I'm looking forward to that. Very cool. And I mean, yeah. It, I've seen the Sistine Chapel when I was in Vatican City, and it is so far up that it's it's you can't see all these details that you see in the exhibit. You know, yeah. you obviously see the famous, you know, the one in the middle, mm -hmm. the yeah. finger touching. <laughs> I'm sure there's a Whatever better, that part is called. better <laughs> name for it. Um, but yeah, you see all of the little pieces of it, so definitely something to check out. You mentioned in our last hour, you both visited, and, and you tried to take a picture, and you said that they <laughs> took your phone. Then yeah. Michelle and I got chatting. Did they give? When did they give? Oh, it they back? gave it back. Okay. Yeah. When so you're, once you're done and you get out, okay. you get your phone back because you can take photos of, you know, Vatican City yeah, and everything so else in, out. I'll just to the Sistine Chapel yes. and then you can. No yep. photos. And I try mm -hmm. to be sneaky. I, I did it like this. They said, ah, 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 and they took it. <laughs> but you can take all the photos you want at the exhibit. So. There you go. That's a <laughs>